Yo, 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 what is up, my fellow YouTubers? It's your boy, the the gothic badass bad boy, King Mumkey, King Jimmy. That's right, here we are. There is no new episode of the Treehouse podcast today because I thought it would be more fun to do this instead. That's right, more Survivor Simulator action. This time around, we're going to take you back to the past to remember a little podcast that sucks ass. That's right, the Procrastinators Podcast. You might not recognize it, but you might know who a few of these people are. Uh, at, at the very least, uh, this handsome uh, monkey fellow right there. But back in what, 2000? 17-ish, I don't remember when, uh, I was for about half a year part of a podcast of all sorts of wacky characters, and I thought it would be fun to have the PCP cast go up against the modern day Simeon Jimmy cast, and we will see not only which era is better, in Survivor they always want to know which era is better, old school or new school, that's basically what we're doing here today, and uh, you know what? There, there's a lot riding on this. Who knows who could win? Some of the greatest villains in internet history could go away victorious. That is the way Survivor sometimes goes. But let's take a look at our PCP cast. To begin, we've got the Ben Saint, one of the few remaining members of the show. Everybody else was either kicked off or quit. Uh, I think it's just Ben and Tommy and Hippo uh, at this point. Uh, we've got Ben's brother, uh, Nate, Nate Saint, who, uh, who should be making more YouTube videos, I think. People say I haven't posted anything this year, but fuck, look at what he's done. His output has been dog shit, so I don't know what's going on there. I could have sworn he quit his job to do YouTube full time. Uh, we've also got the Digital Brony. Now, I know it might not be in vogue to, uh... <laughs> <laughs> to bring up somebody who has decided that after getting cancelled they wanted to change their name, but uh, Here we are. This is you know 2017. This is who that person was so we're just gonna go with it uh, We've got endless Jess a little bit worried about Jess's ability to perform in Survivor. He is known to have some uh, temper issues and uh, likes to abandon his friends and quit so he very well could just get really mad and quit the game about three days in, even though everybody else is begging him to stay. So who knows, maybe that'll happen. Oh, we've got the Hippocrit. Also quit YouTube. We've got Mage, the one that nobody really remembers. But yes, they did have a, a cis woman on the show at one point. And I don't know why she stopped doing it, but I'm sure it was pointless petty drama and they kicked her off. Oh, we've got Monkey Jones, probably the highlight of the show. I always thought he added the most. He had the best opinions on the freedom of speech, and uh, he always uh, made me laugh more than everybody else. Uh, other than Munchie, Munchie is, what I would say, one of the good ones. A uh, very funny guy, one of the few who actually stood up for me and defended me to Endless Bully. Uh, meanwhile, we've got Sai, who was never part of the PCP, but oh boy, did he want to be. He, he tried his very best. And they, they flat out rejected him and talked shit behind his back, but he continued to just uh, praise them and worship them and uh, try to kiss their feet and stuff, so I guess we can include him here. And finally, one of the other one of the good ones, that being Tommy Oliver. Cool guy, we actually did a podcast, just me and him, called The Suicide Perch, like three, four years ago. And uh, that didn't last too long, but... I always enjoyed talking to him. I hope he does well in this game. Now, I will say, it is, uh, it's always been a trend with the PCP to just copy whatever Digi Bro does. And, uh, it seems that a lot of people have, uh, followed in Digi's, uh, footsteps in transitioning. And it has got to the point where I cannot keep track anymore of, of who is what. I, I have no idea which of these people have transitioned to a different gender because it, it has happened too many times from this small group of bronies who would have thought. So I just, uh, when I made the game, I made all of them female. Just to be safe, the worst thing you could possibly do in life is misgender somebody. So I just made them all female. Uh, there's nothing wrong with misgendering a cis person, of course, so I should be fine. Let's take a look at the Sim Jim tribe. 
We've got Biggs, Classic, Eggy. I found a very dapper photo of Eggy on Google. Emperor Lemon, Florian Himsel, Hartsy Protsy, Kino Corner, My Brother Patchy, uh, the, the Trash Rats uh, trio right here. I hope we form an alliance. Uh, Reactor, Rusty, and myself. And without further ado, let's get this game going. I'm very excited to see who pulls this one off. And, uh, you know, let's make some winner predictions while we're here. Uh, I've said this before and I'll say it again. Uh, Digi could really use a win in life right now. Things have not been going well. So I hope she uh, has the opportunity to shine here. Uh, that's my winner pick from that tribe. Who do I want to win on this tribe? Other than myself, of course, and I guess I have two <laughs> opportunities in this game. Uh, Biggs, Biggs d does not deserve a win because he was at the end of the game in the last Survivor Simulator and he fumbled the bag terribly. So, uh, I don't know if he deserves redemption after that performance. I think Heartsy, he probably, he's in a similar position to Digi. I think Heartsy could use a win in life as well. So let's see how the Simu decides to late. And uh, <laughs> PCP tribe, first alliance is Digital Brony, Monkey Jones, and Tommy Oliver. You know what? At, at a certain point in time, that probably was a real alliance. And meanwhile, uh-oh, we're in the minority alliance here. We've got the Brothers Saint teaming up with Endless Mess, Mage, and Psy. And of course, Psy is, is unbelievably loyal, even though the other people in the group are not. Who could have guessed? Uh, let's see what's going on on the Sim Jim tribe. We've got an alliance of Biggs, Florian, and Kino. So I guess that would be the the Kino co-host alliance since they've all been co-hosts on Is a Kino before. Meanwhile, Emperor Lemon Hardseed, my brother. So I guess this is the Autism Alliance. So that's what I'll be calling it. Three of the most autistic uh, men in my life, and of course, uh, nobody invites me to be in an alliance. Simi and Jimmy is left out of alliances on the Simi and Jimmy tribe. Uh, just classic stuff here. And uh, Sim Jim wins Flint, but who cares? Immunity is what matters. And Sim Jim wins immunity! I guess having fire gave us that advantage to perform. And somebody from the PCP is going to get wiped out. I certainly hope it's not Mumkey. Heaven forbid the, the PCP kick Mumkey out first, but I guess that would be good. And Psy finds the idol! I, my guess is the PCP was being rude to Psy, they don't want to hang out with him. He just wants to, you know, vlog at a water park and they're not having it. So he ran off on his own and uh, found an idol. He stumbled upon an idol and good for him. He's probably going to need it. What's going on on the other tribe? Eggy finds the idol, classic Eggy. And me and uh, Kino have a major fight. It's probably because we disagreed about Sallow. He thinks it's better than Back to the Future, and oh, I'm not gonna have that. There is no shit-eating in Back to the Future, and that's why it is automatically the better film. Tribal Council, Sai has the idol. Uh, if, if history bears repeating, Monkey will be voted off first, even though I think Endless Jess did quit before I was kicked off, so it could be either me or Jess. Will Psy play his idol? He might need to. Let's find out. Psy does not play the idol. <laughs> oh no! God! L give the poor kid a break for fuck's sake! Jeez! Are you fucking serious? If PCP votes out Psy with an idol in his pocket on day one, that's just fucking cruelty. Okay, Munchie. 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 Uh oh, it's not looking good for Munchie. He's dressed like a burger. What is he? He's driving us crazy because we're all so hungry on the island. And seeing him in that burger t-shirt is pissing us off. Munchie. Munchie. So Munchie voted outside. Yeah, I could see him doing that. <laughs> That's too bad. Munchie, you're a real one. Never have any beef with you. Uh, pun intended. Next episode. All right, hopefully Sim Jim Tribe can keep the ball rolling. We need to keep the momentum and make sure that we overpower them at the merge with more people. Alliances are staying the same. Nothing new to see. And Sim Jim wins immunity again! Oh, and we get a tarp. That's what you want to see. That's what you want to see. Now that 
um, Munchie is out of the way, will they go after Mum Key? Maybe they just spelled Mum Key wrong, accidentally wrote Munchie, and uh, that's what happened. Uh oh, trouble in paradise. Tommy and Sai have a minor fight. It seems like Sai, every event in the PCP tribe has revolved around him so far. He's a key figure. And nothing's going on in my tribe because we're all hunky dory, happy that nobody's going home. Okay, Sai does not play his idol yet again. Will this be a mistake? Maybe Munchie inspired them to vote for Sai. So, he's gonna get a vote every fucking tribal, I just know it. Every, I'm guessing that was Tommy, because Tommy was pissed at him, but come on. Sai's gonna get a vote every time? Sai. Oh! How? How did I know? It would be me. They can't resist. They cannot resist those motherfuckers. Monkey sigh. Don't make this a monkey and sigh war, because I don't like that at all. Monkey. Oh, why? Why? No. Please let them vote outside before me. I can't live like this. No. Uh, it's all tied up. One vote left. No! <laughs> the PCP has voted to kick out Mumpke by a vote of five to fucking four! <laughs> oh my fucking god, you couldn't write this shit! God damn it. Fine! Fine, you know what? It was to be expected. I'm moving on to bigger and better things, I guess. Well, the PCP tribe is down to really their eight best, I guess. They got rid of... They, they trimmed the fat real quick. No more mum monkey on the... They really hate people with an M name. I, I'm guessing Mage will be next. Uh, let's see what's going on. The Alliance is down to just those two. I, I think they're going to be picked off one by one. There's not a chance that this giant Alliance is going to vote out Psy now. They have a majority in the tribe of five against... Let's see, these two are in an alliance. Who's the eighth person that's not in anything? Uh, Hippo? Nobody wants to be friends with Hippo. And these are all the same. And I'm guessing when the Simjim tribe goes to tribal council, I will also be voted out again because I'm not in any alliance over there. Uh, PCP tribe wins immunity in the mud wrestling competition. So, I guess they got some uh, heavy hitters. I mean, I don't know who's going to go head-to-head -head against Endless Jess. And Ben Saint and Tommy bond a lot. Yeah, they bond over their, their shared hatred of modern day Digibro and the fact that they're basically the only two left on the podcast. Very sad. Biggs and Jimmy bond a lot. Now that's what I want to see. Hey, you know what? I accept it. Maybe that will be the key to saving me from getting voted out at this tribal. If I get voted out twice in a row, I'm just ending the simulator early. You guys don't get to find out who wins. Okay. Are you fucking kidding me? This this cannot be real. This cannot be real life. First vote goes to me. Okay, me. Eggy. I don't like where this is going. Now I'm sad either way. Me. What the fuck have I done to piss everybody off? It's a tie. It's a tie. Four to four. Me and Eggy. Eggy, uh, he has an idol, so he might be in trouble if he didn't play that. Eggy, me, Eggy, two votes left, me, me, literally voted out back to back. My old friends don't want to hang out with me. My new friends don't want to hang out with me. What am I going to uh, simulate survivor games alone in my room? Is that what I'm, the, the fate I'm doomed to? Complete fucking goat shit, pun intended. Well, I are you both happy? Both the tribes, are you fucking happy for voting me out twice in a row? This is, I mean, it's unbelievably unlucky is what it is, but uh, things are not looking good for these two still. And these alliances have not changed. Bonding with Biggs did nothing for me. He did not help me, or maybe he did. Maybe he was trying to vote out Eggy, but still, complete horseshit. Let's move on. PCP wins reward, not immunity. Let's see who gets the actual important challenge win. And Sim Jim wins again, which means it will be seven PCP against nine Sim Jim tribe. And we've got uh, the their alliance has gotten a little bit weaker. It looks like, I guess. I don't know. 
Meanwhile, Kino and Eggy have a major fight. Uh oh, what would they be fighting about? Who is the more Sigma Chad between the two? That is a tough call. Tribal Council, here we go. Psy has the idol. Psy does not play the idol. First vote goes to Digibro. Uh oh, he might be, or she might be, joining me at Ponderosa. Let's see. Best guy ever. Digibro. 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 Uh oh, looks like uh, nobody in the PCP wants to associate with Digibro. Who could have seen this coming? Best guy ever. Digibro. That's it. Six to two. Tommy Oliver is in a lot of trouble because Digi was Tommy's alliance and now he's got nobody. Both of his alliance people were voted out back to back. It's too bad. Let's see what happens next. It is seven to nine. I've got faith in my old Sim Jim tribe to keep the numbers. Here we go. This is the only alliance left. Very sad to see. Sai is in the majority alliance on a failing tribe, but he has an idol, so he might be able to make it to the merge. And these are all the same. And PCP wins reward. They get some chocolate and shit. Who cares? More importantly, Sim Jim Tribe wins immunity. Oh my god, PCP Tribe is down fucking bad. <laughs> down as bad as I can recall the tribe being in this game. They've only won one immunity. And Jess and Ben Saint bond a lot. How cute. Let's move on. Rusty isolates himself from the rest of the tribe. Oh, he might be going through a, a bit of an alcohol withdrawal right now and he just he needs some time alone. He's got those pounding headaches. No one wants to align with him. I would have aligned with him if he didn't vote my ass out immediately. Oh, well. Psy does not play the idol, but it looks like he probably should have. First vote goes to Psy. And there are only seven, so you need four votes to be out. Psy, why didn't you play your idol, Psy? Hypocrite. Uh-oh, it's a tie. Two to two. Psy and Hypocrite. Three votes left. Hypocrite. Ooh, hypocrite, the tribe has spoken. It's time to go back to not making YouTube videos. Here we go. Six to nine. Lay epic funny number. And I I, I found out recently that when I say lay, uh, I'm saying it wrong. <laughs> I guess it, in meme culture, it's pronounced la or some stupid gay French shit. Not for me. I think it's way funnier to say lay, so I'll continue to say lay instead of la or whatever, dumb. Anyway, let's move on. Nothing has changed. Don't know why they show it. And it's a, a double individual immunity challenge. Both tribes, one person will be safe, so both tribes are going to tribal council tonight. So PCP tribe is like extra fucked now. But Jess will not be voted out and Biggs will not be voted out. Okay. And uh, Sim Jim Tribe wins the reward, so we get to watch the other tribes, tribal council, and eat some delicious sausages, vegetables. Oh man. I don't know why I'm saying we when I'm no longer involved. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, nothing has changed. Wait, no, the, the alliance has dissolved? Uh oh. Oh no. I guess, uh, I, I guess if they have to turn on each other, what? They're just not going to be. Uh, aligned at all anymore? Is it every man for him or every woman for herself now? Let's find out. And nothing happens on the Sim Jim tribe. Let's see who's getting voted out of the Sim Jim tribe. Eggy is playing the idol. Does he know that he's getting votes? Eggy does not count the absolute madman. He saw it coming. Aggie does not count. Who is Aggie voting for? Aggie does not count. Aggie does not count. That's five. So he would have been gone. Brilliant idol play. He pretty much gets to decide who's going home. It's not going to be Biggs. Uh-oh. Is it? It's going to be Rusty because he isolated himself. Rusty. Oh, uh, ah. Uh, wait. Too Rusty. Aquino. And yeah. Sorry, Rusty. You shouldn't have isolated yourself. I know it's rough not having booze for, you know, a handful of days, but you can't treat people like that. Let's see who's leaving the PCP tribe, leaving them down to only five members. Decimated, utterly decimated. Nobody has, has an idol. 
And best guy ever has been medically evacuated from the game. Uh, I, I can only imagine he, he didn't get enough protein powder and he just his body shut down. He couldn't handle it. He's done. Endless Jess continues on. He had his idol. You can see it around his neck right now. Or she. Don't want to misgender. And uh, yeah. What a... <laughs> he, he, best guy ever went out in the spot that I went out in the last simulator. So who knows what's going on. PCP Tribe is down to five. Could you imagine if the podcast PCP still existed today and this was the lineup? Ben, Jess, Mage, Sai, and Tommy. <laughs> I mean, I would listen to this show for sure. This is what they should bring back. Meanwhile, Sim Jim Tribe is still going strong. I guarantee uh, the final three is going to be all Sim Jim Tribe members just because there's no way we're going to let these fuckers have a comeback. There's absolutely no way. And, uh, the alliances remain the same. PCP wins a trip to a waterfall, but who will win immunity? PCP somehow, someway wins immunity, so they're not going to be down to four. So now the Sim Jim tribe has a tough decision to make. Uh, but Tommy and Sai are having a major fight. Ah, uh, I, I can't even imagine what this would be about. They seem like such gentle souls. Reactor finds an idol! He's got to redeem uh, Rusty getting voted out. He's got to get his uh, redemption. And the behavior of Heartsy is rubbing the tribe the wrong way. I imagine that's the facial expression he makes when he finds out that everybody is disgusted with him. Like, oh, fuck. Uh, Heartsy, what were you doing? Are you talking about Sonic too much? I almost guarantee that is it, because when I talk to Heartsy, he does talk about Sonic too much, and it does rub me the wrong way. So, you know what? We're, we're speaking truth to power right here. Let's go. Who's getting voted out today? They might go after Eggy. He saved himself with the idol, but now he has... He has nothing. Reactor has the idol. Reactor does not play it, so... This might be Eggy's uh, final march. He might be getting cracked up today. Eggy, yep. You just knew it was coming. Eggy. Ugh. Eggy. Kino. Eggy. Kino. Kino. Wait, we're all tied up? It's a four to four between Aggie and Kino. Were they trying to flush an idol? Maybe they thought one of them found the idol and they wanted to flush it with a tie vote. Will anybody change their vote? If not, then Aggie and Kino Corner will both be safe. Let's find out. Aggie, 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 Kino, Kino. If it's one more Kino, then somebody's about to draw a rock. Oh, shit! Eggy and Keto are now both safe! Which means any of the other people could go home. Other than, uh, nobody has individual immunity. Reactor might go home with the idol in his pocket. He cannot play it. Uh, it might be Biggs. It might be Heartsy. Who can say? We're about to find out. Let's scroll on down. Tie in a revote. Okay, we already did that. We've got Rock Draw. And it's Biggs! Oh, Biggs! Biggs yet again! You should have changed your vote! Why? You know the risk. You knew the risk. What's the reward? You get to keep Kino Corner? It's not worth it. Oh, well. Monkey and Biggs have both been slain, in my case, twice now. And we're down to 12. It's anybody's game at this point. I mean, the tribes are... Starting to equal out a little bit. There are no alliances at all on the PCP. Uh, basically true to this day. And the reward challenge goes to Sim Jim. They get coffee, cookies, who cares? The more important thing is Sim Jim Tribe wins immunity, which means PCP will be down to four people. Just, just do not stand a chance at the merge. Truly sad. Uh, Sai still has the idol. If Sai makes it to the merge of that idol, he could do some real damage. And the behavior of Heartsy is still rubbing the tribe the wrong way. Look, that's his shocked face. That continuing the wrong behavior is still pissing everybody off. Come on, Heartsy, pay attention. Get some social awareness, you curly-haired fuck. Let's see who's getting voted out. I... Now that there is no alliance, and it's every man for himself, every woman for herself, I think Sai needs to play that idol. 
because uh, I don't know. I feel like these four original PCPs might be voting against Sai here. Let's find out. Ooh, mage. Oh, we're getting out the Sizz woman, huh? I see how it is. Ooh, endless Jess. Mage. Ben? What? Wait. So it's a tie, two votes Mage, two votes Jess, one vote Ben. So whoever voted for Ben has to change their vote to one of the other two. So that person will decide who goes home. Okay. And it cannot be a tie again because there's only three votes. Mage. Jess. This is it. Who's going home? It's endless Jess. Looks like there was an end after all. Jess... You did not make it very far into the tenure of the show. Uh, and also, you got voted out of Survivor. Let's move on. PCP is down to four people. But really, it's uh, four of uh, the more interesting people <laughs> to ever be associated with PCP, I guess. Four of the, uh, the more kinder souls of the channel. Meanwhile, we've got just a whole bunch of autism brewing over here. I'm looking forward to when the Sim Jim tribe has to really cannibalize each other after a PCP has been removed. That's when the thing is, uh, the game's gonna get super interesting. Uh, Sim Jim tribe alliance, it's just a Florian and Kino holding down the Kino fort. And uh, the three man autism alliance is still going strong. PCP, hey, they get some Outback Steakhouse. That'll boost their spirits after losing everybody. And they win immunity! They truly needed that! Because having three people going into the merge is not a good place to be. Uh, Mage and Ben Saint have a minor fight, probably over who is the better artist. I know they're both passionate about that. And uh, this alliance is now a little bit weaker. I guess they're getting nervous going into the merge. And who's going home? Reactor does not play his idol. Kino. Ooh, yeah, he got votes last time, so I'm not surprised. Heartsy. Heartsy. No! No, Heartsy was my winner pick on this tribe! Come on! Kino. Kino. Okay, despite Heartsy talking nonstop about Sonic and rubbing people the wrong way two weeks in a row, uh, Kino currently has more votes. Heartsy, oh, it's all tied up. Is this the last vote? Kino, by a vote of four to three, Kino Corner goes home over Heartsy. You love to see it. That's the face he made as Jeff snuffed his torch. Just pure agony. Heartsy, despite pissing everybody off, remains in the game because he, I guess he has that alliance of three. And uh, now Florian is going to be all alone. Florian lost his only companion left. This uh, autism alliance of uh, Emp, my brother, and Heartsy is going to go all the way. Hopefully they invite Eggy in next episode. Four to six, and we're going to the merge, which means if these six form an alliance and stick together, there's really not much these four can do unless Psy knows who they're going to vote for, and Psy plays the idol on them, in which case these four will decide which of these six goes home. But then it's still four to five, so the PCP is fucked. Let's go. The Rip Paw D cast tribe. Here we go. Here we are at the merge with Ben Saint, Aggie, Emp Lemon, Florian Himsel, Heartsy Protzy, Mage, Patchy, Reactor, Psy, and Tommy. And the alliances are just going down tribal lines, it looks like. To be expected. Ben Saint wins immunity! So Ben from the PCP will be safe. If Psy plays his idol, he'll be safe. So either Mage or uh, Tommy are gonna be fucked here. And nobody has found the new idol. There's a third idol hidden out in the jungle. Nobody has found it yet. But the behavior of Florian is rubbing the tribe the wrong way. Oh, oh, but I, I think that the shelter should be uh, built closer to the water so that well, when I sleep, I can hear the soothing sounds of the ocean. And everybody's like, Florian, can you please stop doing that fake fucking European accent? It sounds so stupid. Can't you just speak American like the rest of us? But we're going to tribal council. 
Sai does not play his idol. Sai is under the impression that the Sim Jim tribe is not voting for him. Sai thinks they're either voting for Mage or Tommy. Let's see if his gamble pays off. It might buy him an extra week. First vote goes to Florian. Tommy. I think it's going to be Tommy. 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 Florian. Tommy. Tommy. Florian. Florian. Tommy. Yep, they voted along tribal lines. I mean, yeah, it's, it's to be expected. They only had two choices. Well, three, but if, if they don't know about size idol. Um, yeah, they voted along tribal lines. What do you know? The PCP is down to three people, one of which is Sai. <laughs> um, uh, Heartsy is still in the game. He was, Day one winner pick, Heartsy Protsy, still in the game. I think he might pull this one through. He's, he's in the majority alliance, and then within that alliance, there's a sub-alliance that he is also in. So he might have a one-way ticket to the final three. Yep, it's all gravy. Here we go. And Partsy and Florian get to go watch Treasure Island. I'm guessing they reviewed the movie after and it was just a delightful podcast episode. Mage wins immunity! And if Psy plays his idol, this is the end of Ben Saint. This, this does not spell well for him. Um, ben needed that immunity. And still, nobody has found the new idol. Damn. Since the PCP is down to three, if Ben would have found this idol, then Mage is safe, Sai and Ben can both play idols, and then all three of them would have been safe, but no. Ben refuses to look. The behavior of Emp is becoming appreciated around camp. I have to imagine he is uh, colorfully reviewing an episode of The Simpsons and everybody is just so engaged. Now, th there will never ever be another episode of The Simpsons, like the one when Homer became a superhero known as Pie Man, and threw pies into the face of evildoers. And everybody's like, oh, amp, three million views, baby. That's a quality program I just heard. Let's move on. Uh, will anybody play their idol? Sai, you better fucking do it or you're screwed, buddy. Sai plays the idol, yeah, okay. Now, if everybody voted for Sai, then the PCP is about to vote somebody's ass out. Most likely Florian, because he was pissing them off. Let's see. Psy does not count. Oh my fucking god, they all voted for Psy, which means Psy, Mage, and Ben get to single-handedly, or I guess triple-handedly, decide who goes home. Decide who goes home. That's right. Psy does not count. Psy does not count. They did not split that vote. Could they have split the vote? How many are there? One, two, three, four. Okay, yeah, no. Wait, no, there's nine. So if they would have split it three and three, it would have been a tie and they would have been fine. The Sim Jim tribe did not plan ahead that far. It's too bad. Psy does not count. Psy does not count. Psy does not count. Uh, you know what? I don't even need to make the joke. You guys can make it in your own head. Psy does not count. Tension is high, folks. The next face we see is going home. Florian, yeah, we predicted that one. Sorry, buddy, you gotta go back to Austria. At least you can go back to your delicious, delectable foods. No more eating uh, rice and all that jazz on the island. We're down to the final eight. Five original Sim Jim against three PCP. These three have been holding on for so long, but now they're all out of idols. Hopefully, Sai can use what he learned last time to go find another one. And let's see who wins immunity. Mage wins immunity again. So Sai and Ben are on the chopping block yet again. Mage very well could just win immunity over and over again and make it to the end and win. It has been done before. Go check out season 30. Uh, nobody has found the new idol yet. And, uh oh I think Gep went too far. People really loved hearing his Simpsons review, but now he's talking about NASCAR, and people are not having it. His behavior is rubbing them the wrong way. Uh, Heartsy has a sigh of relief, and no, not S-Y-Y sigh, but an actual sigh of relief that finally the hatred of the camp is being focused on somebody else. He doesn't have to talk about Sonic. 
because uh, we have another autist who is obsessed with things going really fast. And uh, uh oh, this might spell doom for Emp coming up soon. Okay, the actor does not play the idol. Sigh, oh no. Patchy. Patchy. Sigh. I'm guessing it's gonna be Sigh. Patchy. Sigh, yep. Yep, you held on as long as you could, Sigh. And I'm surprised you lasted on the PCP longer than that many other people, to be honest. You played your idol correctly, which was amazing, but... Final eight is as far as you make it, my friend. Final seven. Only two original PCP left. Can Mage continue her hot streak of winning these immunities? Let's find out. Ben so Oh, that's tragic for Mage. That that spells doom. I do not see anybody uh, voting any other way. Ben Saint wins the immunity. Damning uh, poor Mage to being voted out. Oh, shit! Mage found the idol! Things just got spicy! I take back what I said. This is exactly what they needed. Now we have a fucking game. We finally have a fucking game. Ben cannot be voted for. Mage, they're all gonna vote for Mage, and Mage is gonna play the hidden idol, which means once again, the remaining few members of the PCP will have enormous voting power. Let's see what happens. And uh, now they have a medium strength alliance, but hey, they're both gonna be safe. This time around, I'm guessing Mage told Ben about the idol, because otherwise they would have turned on each other immediately because there's, there's no way they both would have survived oh my god i'm so excited to see maybe reactor will play his idol and then the pcp will be voting for whoever reactor plays it on and then we'll have literally no votes that would be interesting maybe that will happen castaways vote mage plays the idol but reactor does not which means reactor might get voted out with an idol in his pocket and I imagine that's the face he would be making if that happened. But here we go. Mage does not count. Prepare to see that five times. Mage does not count. Once again, the PCP pulls it off. Mage does not count. Mage does not count. Mage does not count. The next face is going home. Will it be Reactor with the idol? It's a no! My winner pick is dead at the final seven. Damn it! They got so fucking lucky. Oh, so lucky that you found that idol just in time. And I think they will put it back in the jungle now that it's been used. Damn, Heartsy. You talked about Sonic one too many times. You thought you got lucky when everybody got annoyed with Emp, but no, they did not forget. And of course, that is the face he made when uh, Mage played her idol. Tragic. Down to the final six. The closest that my bloodline might ever come to winning in these simulators, it might be resting on my brother's hands, so or on his shoulders. So I, I might have to just uh, root for my own flesh and blood at this point in the final six. Although, hey, Eggy, they were trying to get him out earlier. I'm surprised he lasted this long. Will these four be able to get out the two remaining PCP members before turning on each other? Or was I wrong in my prediction and will one of these two make it to the final three? Let's find out. The alliances are still completely tribal, just like in real life. Patchy wins a reward and he shares it with Reactor and Emp. That seems like a lovely occasion. But who wins immunity? It's probably going to be Ben or Mage because they keep winning every fucking immunity. But it's Reactor! So Reactor has immunity in the final six. Next round is the final five, which is the last time you can play a hidden immunity idol, which he has, which means Reactor is guaranteed final four. So if you had a Reactor as your winner pick, you are looking very good right now. And uh, Eggy and Emp are bonding slightly, so this might... And this might result in them being in the final three together if they're going to stay true. Tribal. They can't vote for Reactor and he's the only one with an idol. So either Ben or Mage are going to fall here. Mage, I believe, has won more immunities. So they would be smart to vote Mage out. 
because she has the best chance of beating them in the challenges. Let's go. Ben Saint. Okay, I guess I guess they think they can beat Mage. Ben Saint. Patchy. Patchy. It's gonna be Ben. Mage. Literally the least offensive, least bad person to ever be part of the PCP is the only one who remains. Perhaps that's how God always intended it. Here we go. The the Autism Alliance. Wait, who who's missing from the Autism Alliance? I don't remember. I know my brother and Emperor in it. Oh yeah, Heartsy, he got voted out. My bad. But really, Eggy, after bonding with uh Emp, I believe. I mean, that's Autism Alliance right there, too. So, really, any combination of these five would make a fine final three, in my opinion. Okay, who's winning immunity at final five? If Reactor wins it, then maybe he'll give his idol to somebody else. But Eggy wins immunity! Absolutely mogs the competition! Which means the PCP tribe is going to be completely wiped out by the final four, but there might be some trouble in paradise. Eggy and Reactor have a minor fight. Unfortunately, Eggy has immunity. Reactor also has immunity, so there's not much they can do about this. They're both going to be safe, and I think everybody's voting for Mage anyway. But let's go. Reactor would be an idiot to not play his idol, just in case. Reactor does play the idol. Reactor does not count. Somehow, someway, Mage Mage's one vote happened to land on the person who was going to play an idol anyway. Uh, mage, 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 yep. Very predictable. So I guess uh, in terms of old school versus new school, it's very clear that the new school has won, even though, <laughs> even though I have not been a part of either for a long time, it looks like. Who will make it to the final three? I mean, these are four of my uh, dearest friends in real life. I'd be happy to see any of these people win. And you know what? In some way, they all might deserve it. But who's going to win the final immunity challenge guaranteeing a spot in the final three where they can make their case to the jury to win a million dollars? Mmm... Ah... Uh, I I, I still got a root for uh, Apache, my brother. Here we go. But Emp wins the immunity. Tribe events. There are no tribe events. Reactor. Patchy. Oh, Patchy, no! Patchy, no! Eggy. Th three different people got votes in the final four? Oh, no! So this next one decides who goes home, because it cannot be for Emp. He has immunity. Basically, I guess whoever Emp voted for is going home. Uh, uh. And it's Reactor. Oh, he had that idol for so long, he played it. And then as soon as he no longer had that immunity, they got his ass out. Let's see who voted for who. Eggy votes out my brother. I guess he did not like Patchy's camera work during the last Wheel of Cursed Meals. Emp votes for Reactor. I guess Emp is jealous that Reactor replaced him uh, as me and Rusty's podcast co-host. My brother votes for Reactor. I can't even imagine why. I, I, don't, I can't see them having any beef. And Reactor votes for Eggy. Really all over the place with these alliances and stuff. But this is our final three. The final three of... Survivor PCP versus Sim Jim is Eggy, Emp, and my brother Patchy. Uh, th there cannot be a bad winner of this bunch, but I still have my money on my brother. Let's see who wins. The final three. And the winner is... Oh! By a vote of four to three to two! My brother Patchy, who recently just got married, is now going to have one hell of a honeymoon with a one million dollar check and boy that was a pretty close vote let's see how everybody voted jess votes for my brother hey you know what maybe there's no bad blood after all kino votes for my brother tommy votes for my brother florian votes for my brother okay so these four just signed patchy's paycheck meanwhile Cy votes for aggie heartsy votes for amp i gotta stay true to that autism alliance of course uh, ben votes for Amp. Mage votes for Eggy. I mean, yeah, the the one cis woman in the whole game. Of course, uh, she can't resist the charm of Eggman. And Reactor votes for Amp. 
Oh, the irony when didn't Amp just vote Reactor out out of jealousy and now Reactor votes for him to win? Whatever. Fan favorite goes to Ben Saint. Congratulations, Ben. You know what? You deserve it. I follow Ben Saint on Twitter and he's just constantly shitting all over Digibro and encouraging people to unsubscribe from Digipro's Patreon. And Ben's like, if you if you give me evidence that you unsubscribed from Digipro's Patreon, I will literally pay you. So, you know what? He's, he's my fan favorite for sure. I guess the fans really liked the underdog narrative of uh, him and his tribe. But hey, you know what? It, this might be the closest I come to winning one of these games is, is my brother. Oh boy, what a what a hell of a game. Is this not the saddest thing? Just back-to-back -back cuckery. Easy to believe. Alright, well, that is uh, another simulator in the books. And I don't know if I'm going to separate this into two parts or just keep it as one big one. I guess since I'm replacing the podcast with this, this can just be one big video. So you guys don't get to have a, a day of anticipation wondering what will happen next. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope it was watchable, even if it was just me doing a solo show low. No bigs around to uh, join me. But if you enjoyed this and you have recommendations for future uh, simulators, like uh, certain groups of people you want to see compete, let me know. And if you never want to see this again, also let me know so that I, uh, I mean, if you're in that camp, you probably didn't make it to the end of the video, but, uh, hey, I had fun. I hope you guys had fun. And, uh, hopefully, uh, some of the people involved, uh, enjoyed watching it if they clicked on it. So I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>